uh, would be to uh, streamline the appropriation. Uh, our greatest situation right now that the city is dealing with is the management of finances. So in order to uh, give the mayor something to work with or whatever mayor we may have, uh, it's to put together the right uh, pot of money for him to manage. And if you give a person a lot of money, they're going to spend a lot of money. So you gotta got to cut, cut a little bit to make sure that we're operating correctly. Uh, one of the goals that, that I have in mind is a five-year strategic plan. And in that five-year strategic plan, it involves all sectors of how we operate from both uh, the infrastructure of East Cleveland upon all departments, and then it funnels over to the city uh, aspect in partnerships with the school district and partnerships with the library and then partnerships with our business and, and current corporations. Uh, having a strategic plan gives you an outline and a direction as to where you should go. Uh, East Cleveland hasn't had a plan, I don't believe, since Anwar. Uh, and, in, and in that, you know, when different mayors come in, different objectives, different, different mindset. So one mayor from the next mayor does not pick up where the other mayor left off. They start their own thing. And that has been the failing grace. I may not agree with everything that Gary Norton does as mayor, but if I were to take over after that, I would have to continue some of the objectives that were positive. But the most important thing is remaining transparent, streamlining our appropriation, providing some transparency of our government continually, uh, and also our county partnerships. Anthony Harrison has been great. He has been uh, responsible for a number of projects. This council has, has stepped up to the plate to get a lot of the street repairs done, the county roads through his office, and we, we see much of that happening right there on Noble Avenue. And hopefully Shaw is coming next. Thank you, Mr. Baker. All members have spoken on that issue. So are there any rebuttal? Mrs. Thomas. 30 seconds. I only have a rebuttal to my um, opponent's um, comment. Um, as you know, we council people are supposed to know what's going on in our city. And I don't think that, uh, and it might be just an oversight, but the other day I found out that the Boys and Girls Club, which we already have, applied for a grant through GE and won that grant. They are over now in our Civic Center, and they're building up the Civic Center. And that is the rebuttal, and I'm also going to rebuttal my colleague's uh, remark. I'm going, I know you're saying the time is up, but up. I have to say this, I'm gonna say this, but my colleague is saying streamline uh, the uh, City Hall uh, Mrs. The people. Mrs. Thomas, we've already cut it to me, the bottom. Excuse me, Thank you had 30 sorry. minutes. You have any closing remarks? We can do, deal with that. I said 30 seconds. That's what I you have. So Thank you. I'll remind you of that. I, I, you do. You can do can I give 30 seconds to my own comment? Yes. Uh, what I stated to, to, to my uh, colleague here is that streamlining the budget. The budget, I was not necessarily talking about people, I was talking about our operational expenses. So that goes along the lines of going paperless, the, you when I say the internet business hub, and also uh, you know, putting together some practices that require us to be a little bit more uh, citizen friendly. No rebuttal. Yes, I, just, I said the Boys and Girl Club definitely need to be in our ward because sometimes when they be going down the street kids go into gangs and stuff and it's too far in the winter time i'm saying that the budget of city hall if they don't have a budget that means somebody ain't doing their homework and if you don't do a budget then money is spending in the wrong places at the wrong time and you don't even know where it's going so if i ever become which I am running for council, I would try to make sure that that budget is seen by not only for us, but for our community. You will have a budget. Thank you.